Half Sword is a physics-based medieval combat simulator featuring historically accurate XV century arms and armor. Disclaimer, Half Sword is being made. It's not done. Alright, that's fine. Warning, this game is a gory game. Uh-oh. Hopefully my mom doesn't see me play in this one. Okay, here we are as a guy. There's that guy. I like all games that have, like, attempting some sort of a realistic sword system. This is looking more like a co-op type game. But it's physics-based, so that's good. Uh, you're a lantern. Can I have you? Can I have this? What is this? The, oh, the lid is the shield. That, oh, he's going to kill me. He's going to kill me. Stop. I don't have a weapon. I don't have a weapon, dude. I'm unarmed. Holy crap. He cleaved my heart out of my body in one swing. Restart. Yeah, restart. I didn't get a weapon. Oh, there is a weapon. Okay, maybe you're supposed to die. Hey, give me whatever that is. I want that. Can I have it? I punched forward. There's some legs here. Give me, give me that at least. Give me the shield. Give me the buckler. Can I have the buckler? Can I have the little the lamp post? How do I pick the lamp post up? Is there controls, 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 controls? Switch view, right hand swing, grab. Okay, Q and E are the grabs. So Q to grab that? There we go, okay. Fear the wrath of my candelabra, bad guys. Who wants to get candled? Now I'm ready. I'm ready for battle. Oh, there's someone. The Jester. Thinks he's so funny with his hammer. Oh, he got me good. Am I dead from that? He knocked the candle out of my hand. Okay, this is not going well. Maybe the candle was not the best weapon. I'm gonna need an actual weapon to kill these guys. Maybe I should learn how to swing the sword, because currently I can't swing the sword. That would help, probably. Was it left click to swing right hand? No, right hand swing is left. Okay, so it's, it's reversed. It's dishonored controls. Gotcha. I have the shoes as armor. Nice. Need a weapon. Cortana, I need a weapon. I have nothing but shoes, Cortana. Oh, God. Don't candle me, please. Well, that wasn't really fair. I didn't really have... I didn't have anything. All I had was shoes. A man just emerged from the dark and beat me to death with a candelabra. Just you wait till I find any sort of weapon. Oh, there we go. There's a weapon. Business time. Business. Now we're in it. I dropped it. Come back. Come back. Give me the blade. Give me the blade. There we go. Oh, and I can swing. Here we go. Oh, they're dead, dude. They're dead. I'm winning for sure. Can you thrust? Is there thrusting? I'm gonna give him a wide swing. Swing, batter, batter, swing. Beat him up. <laughs> Kill him. I'm like getting over a guy. Getting over a guy is out of the pot, and he's pissed. Oh, I dropped my hoe. Give me the hoe back. Oh my god, he slit my throat. Get him. He's on the ropes. I'm on the ropes too, though. Okay, that NPC does not like me. I want to get one kill. I want to master the quap bat system and get one kill. That's my current goal. I wouldn't survive five seconds in the medieval era. Can I respawn, please? Why does the respawn take so long to actually activate? Restart. This game's kind of brutal. I mean, it said it was brutal. It warned you. Give me the hat. Can I have that, too? Ooh, there we go. Not bad. Can I have this whole wooden thing? Is this a weapon? Uh, the candle's weapon, though, right? Here we go. Wait, come here. 
Come here. Aha. I'm just going to give him one of these. Come here, I'm going to give you one of these. Yeah, you better be afraid. I'm the tornado. The human tornado. Yeah, get him, get him. Yes. The human tornado has finally killed someone. He had a knife. Can I have his knife? That's probably pretty strong. Oh, here we go. Now we're in business. All right, now we're getting medieval. Here we go. The human knife NATO. Who wants some, huh? Who wants some of this? There's a guy. Here's a victim. Kill him. Yeah, make him a victim. Yeah, take him down. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This is extremely violent quap. I right, got him. He's dead. Easy kill. Treasure? Are you treasure? It opened. What was inside? Was there anything inside? Who can say? Come on, I'm ready for another victim. There's one. Get him. Take him down. Oh, no. I got hammered. I got hammered. It's okay. I got him. I got him. Am I still up? Am I dead? Oh, I died. Come on. I had the knife. I was doing so good, dude. I was doing so good with the knife. You died. Mm-hmm. Right, give me a better spawn. This is kind of like a RNG, like, roguelike thing for the demo, I guess. Can I get a sword? A sword would be cool. A sword would probably be too strong, though. That'd be too good. I'm not liking having no helmet. I had a helmet last time. Now I'm Minecraft guy. I'm Minecraft's Eve. Okay, nothing is in the box. The box is empty. Can I have the candle? Give me that candle. Ooh, dual wielding. Hang on. Ooh, ho, 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 ho. look at this. This is going to be deadly. I got the candle for range and the pickaxe for puncturing. Here we go. I think you're so good wearing a t-shirt. Just because you're wearing Jester's clothes doesn't mean I can't kill you with a blade. Take him down. Yeah, take him down. Right, he got he got taken down. He is dead. He's stuck on my pickaxe, though. Get your leg off of there. Get your femur off of my pickaxe. I need that. There we go. Jerk. Look how much blood is on there. That is a lot of blood. That is so much blood. What we got here? Ooh, ooh. Oh, he wants it, though. He wants it. Hang on. It's mine. I saw it first. I saw it first. Want that axe. Okay, he's dead. His, his lung is punctured. He got punctured. One more lung for him. Give me that axe. Oh, yeah. Seagird style. He's still up? Not for long. I work for Bellathor at the general goods store. Come by Bellathor's shop at the market. I'm sure we've got something you need. All right, now we're in business. Now I got range and the blade. I can do both now. Two kills, new record. Can I get three? Give me three kills. There's one. Just a t-shirt guy. Take him down. Take him down. <laughs> Kill him. Chop him up. You gotta be brutal to get a kill on this. They keep getting back up if you don't kill them. Now I understand why the NPCs were doing that to me. Is that an actual sword? Oh, a pitchfork. That could be good. Could be good for stabbing. Is that a better axe? I probably want the pitchfork instead of the uh, the candle, right? Yeah, give me the pitchfork for range. Now I'm lighter. I'm more lightweight. The great London simulator. Uh-huh. I only seen one knife, though. So not, not very London-esque at all. Oh, God. He's going to do some damage to that thing. Not if I do damage first. 
Perfect. His chest cavity has been properly collapsed. Did he have an ore? He was trying to boat me to death. You think I'm going to die to a boat? Skyrim, Seagird's Nightmare. There should be a Seagird mod. They should mod Seagird into this. Oh, he's... Oh, my God. He blunted me. His blunt object got me. You mastered the blunt, but I mastered the blade. Oh, I cut his arm off. What the heck? I was wondering if it had dismemberment. Uh, it does. It's got dismemberment. Holy crap. Who else wants to be dismembered? Anybody? I'm taking any and all challengers. I have four kills. I'm completely unstoppable. Unless somebody has like a bow. A bow would probably kill me in one hit. Here's the arm guy. Can I have the arm? Can the arm be a weapon? That'd be funny. Oh yeah, the dismembered arm is a weapon. Nice. Dead space style. That's not even... Uh, in dead space you can... uh You can throw limbs at people. He dropped it immediately though. Use it as a weapon. There we go. I'm gonna punch you with this guy's arm. Come here. Emerge from the darkness. They'll get the arm back. Oh, it despawned? Oh no, it despawned. Give me my range back. Where'd my range go? I'm never gonna find it again. Oh no. Better stay back. I'm Seagirded. I'm not afraid to do you use it. Oh, he's got a knife. He's got the advantage in close quarters. He's got a big advantage. Ooh, right in the back. He's down, he's down. Finish the job. Finish the job. Finish the job. There we go. Alright, job is done. That was close. Close call. The knife gave him a good advantage. I gotta find some range again. Need my range weapon. This infinite dark void is effectively shrouding. Oh, the helmet. Yeah, I want the helmet. That's good. At the gambeson. I used it. The candle can become my range again. I got my range back on the candle. Alright, here we go. The classic loadout. The loadout you know and love. It's stuck behind my legs. Why is he holding it like that? Hold it the other way. Hold it like this. There we go. Oh, it's still stuck behind his legs. Did it fix it? Yeah, it fixed itself. Good. All right, now I got a huge loadout. I don't know if the health is regenerating or not, because I have taken a lot of hits. I've been stabbed multiple times. Oh, God. This guy is ready to go. He sights me. I'm done for. I'm done for. Getting close. Getting close. His weakness is close range. Get him. Finish him off. Get him. Get him. Don't let him stand. Don't allow him to stand. Yeah, right in the head. Perfect, perfect, perfect. That was a close call. Things were looking grim for a second there. Give me the scythe. Oh, yeah, now I'm the Reaper. Don't fear the Reaper, but you should fear me. What the? Another guy. Sickle guy. Oh, God. Oh, God. I died to a communist. Classic communism. Classic communism. By one weakness. How'd they know? Okay, spawning by Santa clothing. That's not bad. I'll become Santa Claus. Sickle guy was Scythe guy? That was, He got back up? He was missing an arm. He survived missing an arm? That's crazy. Okay, well now I know to confirm the kill on that guy. If I can find the fence... Then I can find the edge of the boundary. They don't know where I am. I right, candle him. Candle him. This is like a level one guy. All he has is a bottle, dude. He's a re-bottler. Doesn't even make his own brand. It's a bit inefficient of a weapon here. <laughs> Beating him to death very slowly. This is very slow. He'll die, but it'll take a while. It might take a couple days. Are you dead yet? 
Are you deceased? He's still coughing. He's still coughing. We can't have that. Go for the head. Hit him in the head. He's still going, dude. Come on, dude. Die. Just get out of here. I keep hitting the ground instead of him. If I slide it. Yeah, there we go. I'll slide it across the ground into his face. There we go. That's a good tactic. That ought to do it. Are you dead now? Santa's elf came to play. Dude, he's still going. And kill him. Okay, he died. Good, I got him. This weapon sucks. This thing is not good. I gotta find some better loot, like the scythe. The scythe was cool, but I didn't get a chance to use it. Oh god, double hammer. It's a hammer guy. Oh god. Gotta use my range to my advantage. My only hope. If I can get him on the floor, I can start beating his face in. There we go. The auto-generated YouTube transcript for this video is definitely getting it demonetized. There we go. Now I can beat a skull. In. There we go. Now his head collapses. Give me your hammer, actually. The hammer probably kills him faster. Kill him with his own hammer. Yeah. The verdict is... Not alive. Alright, now I got a hammer and a range. Not terrible. Oh, that's better, though. Immediately ditch the hammer. Immediately give me the axe. Give me that axe. Come on. There we go. Now we're in business. I was just one sickle away from becoming communist myself there. Oh, here we go. Oh, pitchfork guy. Getting close. Oh, the axe is good, dude. What the heck? The axe is strong. Who would have thought the axe is an effective weapon? No, stay down. Don't get back up. No one said you could stand. All right, there we go. He's missing half his body now. That ought to put him down. Give me the pitchfork. All right, good loadout. My loadout is solid. There's some two loot things over here. Lots of candles. Oh, you're so done, dude. That's the weapon I used to have. When I was just a level one crook, I had that. But now I'm a level 100 boss. My pitchfork is stuck inside of his chest. There we go. Are you dead? Are you still going? You shouldn't still be going if you know it's good for you. Better stay down, son. A blue shirt? Yeah. What the? The blue shirt was hostile. Where'd my axe go? Give me the axe back. Didn't think the blue shirt would try to kill me. I'm a gnome, and you've been gnomed. All right, the music changed. I think that means the armor guys are going to spawn. I think sickle guy is coming out soon. Coming soon to a gloomy arena. Cloaked in shadow near you. Add us this guy again. This guy sucks. Get this guy out of here. Give me a real battle, please. Yeah, no more leg for you. No more arm for you. You've been a naughty boy. You lose both your limbs. Any good loot over here? Uh, there's an axe. Is that a better axe than the one I have? I think it's the same model. Is it the same model? No, it's, it's the spiky guy. It's like a spike on the end of it type axe. Like a halberd kind of thing, maybe? Bill hook? Isn't it a, a bill hook? Is bill hook the word? It was kind of bill hook esque. Isn't that right, oarsman? Send me the bill. Alright, he's dead. He's hooked on phonics. He's bill hooked on phonics. Where's one of those sickle guys? I think I've killed enough now. I think I've killed enough that the sickle guys should be spawning. He sure guy again. Fine with me. It's like I'm conducting the orchestra. 
Dun 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 dun. Wish I could take some of these dead guys' pants. My poor man has not had pants for this entire game. T-shirt guy again. Oh, it's the stool guy. Okay, maybe the enemy spawns are the same every time. Maybe this is the same map every time. That's why I keep running into these t-shirt guys. I'm not in the sickle guy territory. This is what it's like to get murdered by the Muppet Chef. Lots of arm flailing. POV, you're playing as the Muppets from My Friendly Neighborhood. That's a pretty good swing. Oh, there he is. My nemesis. Oh, we got... Dude, come on. Come on. Ah. Oh, I just finally got over to him. I didn't have a chance, dude. His sickle just scythed me down. Tell him the scythe's gonna... Put him down. Oh, this thing is my starter this time. Oh, leg. Oh, pants. Pants. Dude, I got pants. Hang on. We're in business now. Never before have I been so adequately garbed. Ah! Spank him. Spank him. This is the spanker. He's got an actual blade, so he should have won that. Dude. We can put a baseball bat and a crowbar in this game and finally decide who will win, baseball bat or crowbar. This is the game that can decide it. Club versus crowbar, who will win? You had a knife, right? Oh, I can drag the guy. Yeah, give me your ear. Give me your ear, you don't need that anymore. I demand a tribute to five earlobes. Are you pants? Ooh, you're an axe. Can I get it? Can I have it? Can I have it, please? Did it fall out? Yeah, it fell out. Yeah, I'll two-hand the axe. Why not? My sprinting blade combat style. You fool. You saw me running towards you, flailing my blade, and you chose to engage me in a duel? What were you thinking? Enemy has pants, RP, enemy has pants. Is there a kick? There's a camera mode. Okay, didn't know why there's a camera mode. Is there a kick? I can't run and I can't kick. Oh, there's a lock on, there's Dark Souls lock on. And thrust is right mouse button plus two. Interesting. That was more of a block. Maybe you have to have like a pokey weapon to thrust. What button was that? Photo mode? The photo mode might be useful. There it is. Can I get a free cam? There we go, free cam. Let me stand by the guy. Let me get him swinging. Gotta swing the blade. That's good enough. All right, free cam. There we go, that's pretty good. It's a good shot. A hide UI. Screenshot, perfect. Put that on the store page. Let's find some more foes. I wanna take a screenshot of dead scythe guy. Ooh. I'm almost fully clothed now. Just missing the shoes. Well, he has shoes. These things came with shoes. That's pretty good. I get the lid off of here. Ooh, dual wield. Dual wield. I feel like maybe just having it two-handed is better than dual wielding, honestly.
Where's my next foe? There he is. Come charging forth from the darkness against me. You fool. That guy's just like a crash test dummy. This is the combat arena, not the car crashing arena. You're in the wrong arena. You're in the wrong business, buddy. What's in here? Strahd Von Zarovich. Nope, just shoes and an axe. Both of which I already have in much supply. What are you? Oh, it's a different different hat style. Ooh. Oh no! No, the hat! The hat was bait! Oh my god, the Red Hat Society! It was the Red Hat Society, they got me! The Red Hat Society, man. I can't believe they're back. I got the shoes, though. I needed the I needed the axe on the shoes. Give me the axe, give me the axe, give me the axe, give me the axe. Give me the candle. I'll use the candle even. Stupid Red Hat Society. Thought I was done dealing with the Red Hat Society, but they tracked me down and attacked me when I least suspected it. All right, he's done. You had an axe on you, right? Yeah, give me my good weapon back. Give me the blade. There we go. I'm flailing wildly. Ooh, so your, your mistake was not wearing clothes. You gotta wear clothes if you wanna fight me. Clothing is necessary. The Red Hat Society sends its regards. I think the Red Hat Society ever goes to one of those axe throwing places. Is that a thing the Red Hat Society does? One of their favorite events? What are you? You're like a small axe. You're a weird axe. They had some scissors. Scissors weapon? I'm liking the long axe. The long axe is pretty good. Got a lot of force behind it. Got a lot of power. Trying to get in close. I always keep my foes at range, you fool. Why am I not using the blade now? What happened? Use the blade. Oh, oh my god, I cut his head off. Nice. Yeah, he's holding it weird. Hold it right. There we go. Now he's holding it right. Good kill, thanks. Just one swing, one kill. That's how we do it. Got to account for the Coriolis effect. All bladesmen learn that at a young age. Get out of here. I'm trying to open the loot crate. I'm trying to open the loot box. Go for the head. Go for the head. Hey, can I run a few ideas? Run a few ideas by? Let me uh, pick your brain. There we go. He's dead. Once one of the limbs comes off, they're basically done. He's back! Not today. Not this time. Not this time. Take him down, take him down. I'm in close range, stay close, guys, stay close. He lost his sickle, he lost his sickle. He lost his weapon. He lost his weapon. Take him down, take him down. Oh, I did it. I got something. I got a card. I did it. I vanquished a sickle foe. Commemorate the occasion with a good screenshot. Perfect. Beautiful. I did it. Steal his identity and become the sickle guy? I don't think you can take clothes off of dead enemies, unfortunately. I can take the sickle, though. There we go. Ooh, it's sweeping. I don't know, because close range is your weakness with a sickle, though. You're only good at long range. Let's try it out. A fellow red hat. Ah, you're in the society, too. Who let you join? Oh, my God. The sickle is really good. The sickle clefts him in twain like no one's business. Good for cutting grass and cutting down foes. I 
I'm just gonna garden, and if you walk into my gardening blade, that's your fault. Holy crap, the sickle is so strong, dude. It's so powerful on this. Holy crap. He's dead. I like to say, holy crap. Other guy. Oh, it's a blue hat. The blue hat, no! The natural enemy of the red hat is the blue hat. Run. Just gotta kite him and get back to my sickle. That's all I gotta do. You fool. You left my weapon unguarded. I didn't get it. Crap. I gotta stand on it longer, I think. Give me it back. Oh my god, give it back. Give me the leg. He's got a real short range axe. Give it back. Just give it back. I need it. Oh, he's swinging. He's swinging. He's swinging. Why can't I have the sickle back? I won't let me get it. It's my only hope. There's candles over here. Is there an item over here I can have? Give me that. What is this? Tankard. Tankard. No. I was a fool to come out with a tankard. A tankard had no chance. Of course a tankard failed. I'm not dead. I'm not dead. I'm not dead. I'm still in it. I'm still in it. I'm not in it anymore. He got me. Maybe. Maybe, though. I'm dead. I'm dead. Can't we settle this over a pint? He declined that proposition. In a violent way. And those blue hats are crazy. I am a blue hat now. Once you die, you become a blue hat. Forced to use the candle to slay your foes. It's like Happy Wheels without wheels. Yeah, kind of. Yeah, it does have the violence of Happy Wheels. It has like the controls of like a co-op type game. I need, to, I need to thrust mode for this. What's thrust mode? Alt is thrust mode, I think. Okay, I was trying to learn the new controls. That was not a good time to learn them. Give me a hug. We can hug it out. We can be friends. Peace. We can have peace. Peace is the answer. Stop hitting me with your hook. We gotta have peace. Yeah. How's that for peace? Okay, now I can get my thing back. There we go. All right, peace time. Nope, hang on. Oh, is my arm wounded? Is, like, my arm too wounded to use it? Yeah, because that arm can use it fine. Okay. Peace time. Show him how we negotiate in Geneva. The true power of the Geneva Convention unleashed. There we go. Leave that in his chin. My right arm is disabled, I think, so I'll use the crappy hook. And the left hand slicer. Watch out for me. I really am a little goblin guy. I think my hand is too busted to use that. I can use the axe, probably. Oh, no, no! Please, please! Get out of here, orange pants. What's that even supposed to be? Show them how we negotiate in the Polish-Lithuanian Commonwealth. Yeah. Give me a little Commonwealth action. Poland-Lithuania is a fun faction to be in Empire Total War. The color of their uniforms in that game is very pleasing to the eye. In case you're looking for a recommendation of what faction to play in Empire Total War Darth Mod. There you go, that's a freebie. You can have that one for free. Try your right hand to see if you regen health. Good idea. Yeah, I think my right hand regen because I can carry his foot around now. Weird hook thing. Give me the weird hook thing. Nice. I'm ready for extreme violence now, yet again. He wants some. He wants some? Oh, ah! Face the wrath of my Muppet arms. 
flail never fails. Hashtag flail never fails. There should be a flail, dude. A flail, like, with the chain? That'd be a fun weapon in this. That'd be some good physics. That'd be awesome. This would be terrifying in VR. Well, in virtual reality, this game is called Blade and Sorcery. Mine is the uh, omnipresent dark void. In Blade and Sorcery, there's, like, a map. Hashtag epic flail. There you go. Get that trending. But yeah, Blade and Sorcery is basically what it is this in VR. Oh, he's got the range on me. He's got the range on me. But his weapon is gone. Oh, what's the matter? Did you drop your weapon on the floor? You are unwise to lower your defenses. You would 100% impale yourself on a flail. You would hit yourself with it and die. That's why it would be so good, though. It would be a funny weapon. The blue pants will complete my look. Perfect. No, not the candle. Ooh, the bill hook. Give me that one. Yeah. I got range again. I am once again a ranged combatant. So you use your range to block them, then you move them with your small range guy, and you stab them up good. You know a game is good when it has a demonetizable amount of violence. That's how you know a game is a real good game. I'm definitely buying this full game when it comes out. This is just like a point three beta demo. Like the store page for this has like levels and knights and stuff. This is just like a demonstration of the combat mechanics and the combat mechanics are hilarious. So if this has like missions where you like fight a knight, that'd be awesome. Oh, speaking of, speak of the guy I hate to see. Oh, I got him. That was fast, dude. That was a fast kill on him. I must have got him in the throat or something. All right, try my luck with your weapon again. Last time it didn't go so well. There we go. It's almost harvesting season. All right, who wants some? Who wants to get reaped? Time to reap what you sow. Well, that's a, that's a mace guy. He's got a mace. I want the mace. He had a new weapon. That wasn't fair. I wasn't ready for a mace. Yeah, the flail, the flail was good in the NPC's hand, but honestly, it kind of sucks. Not the flail. The scythe, I mean. Okay, yeah, you got me. You got me fair and square. You got me fair and square. Can you imagine Skyrim with these mechanics? Oh, that'd be good. Imagine imagine Skyrim with good combat. I mean, imagining Skyrim with good combat is what modders have been trying to do for over a decade. With mild success, if by good combat you mean Dark Souls, people have successfully modded in you can lock on a Dark Souls role in Skyrim. Is that good for Skyrim though? I don't know. Oh, he's, he's keeping me at a distance. He's keeping me at bay. This guy's keeping me at bay real good. Oh, I dropped my weapon. That's not good. I need that. But if I go get my weapon, he'll keep me at bay. I gotta stay close if I have a chance to survive, which I don't. Don't swing that. Don't do it. I need my eyeballs to see. Don't poke them out. Oh, there we go. Take his weapon. Take his weapon. Take his own weapon. There we go. Perfect. And now, young Skywalker, you will die. Maybe, if I can figure out how to stab. <laughs> there you go. Get that screenshot. That's awesome. You can see the eyes. That's a good one. Not bad. Look him in the eyes when you kill him. Are you you're not dead? Dude, your brain is exposed. What do you mean you're not dead? Your brain is hanging out. Put him down. Put him down. 
I'm trying. I'm trying, buddy. I'm trying to put you down. I'm sorry. There's your Christmas card. Mm -hmm. Happy holidays from Obo Shoes Gaming. It'd be a good Christmas card if he was dressed like the elf again. If I had the Santa colors on. If you hold the scythe the other way, it's a thousand times better. Yeah, I might have been holding it wrong. Might have had it flipped the wrong way. What is this thing? Look how long this guy is. Oh, it's just the hoe. Eh. I'll try it. Uh, oh, he's got the club. He's got that blunt object. There we go. Got him. All right. Till the field. Till the field. Give me a bounteous harvest. All right, consider that field tilled. The field has been tilled. I repeat, the field has been tilled. Who wants to get tilled? You want some tilled? Plant the crops. What was he holding? What is that thing? It's a weird looking knife type guy, I think. What did you have? Plant them. I'm planting, I'm planting. That thing looks like it sucks compared to my hoe. Cultivated. A cozy farming simulator. Half sword is a cozy farming sim. Use randomized items to try and grow your farm. Unlock a variety of pants and hat colors and styles. Take him down. Think you're a hot shot because you got pants on? Us real farmers don't need pants to do our duty. Is he dead? He's probably dead. And if you see a guy like that, he's probably not an alive guy. Deceased is a safe bet if you come across an image like that on your travels. Why am I holding it weird? I'm holding it weird. Why is he holding it weird? Dude, the hoe is pretty good. The peasant levy in Total War Warhammer should be way stronger than it is. They got a good range on this thing. I reset the grip. Or double. Oh, I could dual wield. I'd go for some dual wielding. Yeah, I'd go for some double action. There we go. Now I can use the hay and the crops in the ground. Oh, the windmill, the windmill formation. Holy crap. All right, give me a guy. Give me a guy. I got to use the windmill formation on him. The old Don Quixote. Who wants to get coyoted? Who wants it? Oh, he's, oh, he came right behind me. All right, windmill, windmill him. Windmill, windmill for the land. Turn forever, hoe in hand. Take it all in on your stride. I think that guy died. Right, he's probably dead. He's probably not living. Oh, there we go. The Red Hat Society would like to welcome a new member. Farmer Joe. Old McDonald. There we go. Old McDonald had a scythe. E I E I O. There's the barstool guy. Be gone, barstool. Just die already. Come on. There we go. Right in the throat. Once you get the jugular, you're pretty good to go. Dude, the medieval era was messed up. This is an accurate simulator of the XV century. I'm glad I live in gun times. At least guns look cool. The hoe doesn't even look cool, and it's very painful. No mercy. Snammy bug, remember, gnome gnomish. All right. Intestines on the floor, intestines on the floor. This game is fun. 
Oh, he's back. Oh, no. Please. Please. Oh, he, oh, he. I think he cut me in twain. I think I was cleft in twain by the scythe guy that time. That scythe guy is a tough enemy, dude. He'll get you. That scythe guy will kill the crap out of you. Okay, uh... Is there anything else in this demo? There's restart, continue, settings, quit. So I guess there's no menu. I guess there's no other mode besides this. Honestly, there doesn't need to be another mode besides this. Anything else they add is just the cherry on top of an already amazing game. This game's real good. Go uh, wishlist Half Sword on Steam and pre-order Half Sword on Steam and buy Half Sword on Steam. Did I just die from falling over? Did I die from tripping? Is that what happened? Get up. Stand. I'm Gollum. <laughs> Smeagol. We would never hurt, nice master. I can knife Smeagol kill somebody. Give me that knife. There we go. Now knife Smeagol. Oh, he stood up. There we go. All right, Smeagol's back in the game. We would never hurt, nice master. Come here, nice master. Oh crap. Oh no. Oh my God. Stop. Stop. This is what Sam should have done to Smeagol a long time ago. R.I.P. Smeagol. I like how the NPCs just stand there and hit your head repeatedly. It's pretty good. This whole game is pretty good. Developers of this game, you have my support. Update what happened. Update this game with more content. And I will play all of said content. This is a, this is a true classic in the making. A real great game. It's a carnivore, buddy. A real meat eater.